Jay Hernandez and today's video we got I guess you could say one of the most hyped sneakers right now that just released um, my girl actually hit on um, the exclusive axis and I'm recording on my phone because I gotta ship this shoe right out she ended up selling the sneaker um, we couldn't keep it because it wasn't my size she accidentally made a mistake and got a ten and a half in a men's size instead of a ten and a half women's which would be my size nine but I'm not really tripping because she made a good amount of money off of it. So that's cool. She she got her own little W. But let's open this thing up. And then I'm going to compare them really quick to these fives. And we're just going to see which one is the better of the two. So let's open this up real quick. Sorry, I'm not. I'm on my phone like I said. And I don't have nothing to hold the camera. So it's going to be a little sloppy. But we're going to get this thing open. I'm not trying to show my... Uh, not trying to show my address or anything like that. So I'm gonna open this up here. And open this up here. I got it. Um, all right, there we go, we got it open. And honestly, when you hit on something crazy like this, your first uh, reaction when you open the box is, I hope they didn't send me a GR for the wrong shoe. But I'm gonna get this thing open real quick and just like your Jordan 5 box, this one's got the little holes on it. Um, a lot of people are making fun of it because of the how it looks like a little rat, like a little rat house or whatever. Like, you know, it is what it is. But you got your regular Jordan 4 box, only with the holes. It's got all kinds of holes on it. Um, and then you got your sizing right here, which is a 12, 10 and a half men's. Retail was 200 or like 217 or something like that. I really don't know because she's the one that paid for it with her account. So they got to the little bubble right there, the bubble that usually comes with the fours. And let's open this thing up, man. So, of course, you got the red underneath the four box. And right off the, the bat opening this thing up, I could smell a very strong smell. The shoe looks very nice. Uh, behind this uh, plastic paper, it definitely looks like a browner color, almost like those mushroom woman's shoes that came out a while back. But it definitely does smell very, very good. When I see this little off-white thing, it reminds me of the DHL, of the DHL uh, box. So, and don't mind the background noise. My girls over there cooking. Um, like I said, I gotta make this real quick. And I want to say thank you to everybody that's been showing love and, and subscribing to the channel. Thank you guys so much. Remember, we are doing a giveaway. Um, if you're watching right now, we are doing a giveaway. Go to my giveaway video, put in your size uh, in the sneaker that you would like to receive on the reverse bread lows. Make sure you guys join that giveaway. But anyway, you guys see that laces are not attached. You guys saw that I just opened this up from Nike. So that's just how it's going to come. Laces will not be attached. If they are attached, then you got a situation in your hands. Um, but you got the gent man right there. Uh, it's a very clear, more like a plastic bag uh, feel. It's not like a wax paper. This is like a plastic bag, um, like what you get at a store. Uh, but yeah, so let's take the shoe out. And the shoe looks very, very, very nice. You got your air right here on the midsole. Um, you got your white midsole with this creamy translucent outsole. Um, got your Nike on the bottom. It's almost like a greenish uh, color. And then, you know, uh, just a, a three different colors on the outsole of the shoe. Just a very, very, very nice sneaker, in my opinion. Um, but what I am going to say is that it, they could have definitely done a better job for the ladies if this was supposed, meant to be, this was meant to be a woman's uh, shoe. So I feel like they could have given them a better color. And I feel like it was kind of a lazy job uh, with uh, Jordan brand or with Virgil just on making this shoe because... I feel like they just could have added something to it. I feel like the off-white four, the very first silhouette of the off-white could have been something different instead of this uh, very, uh, very uh, plain color. You guys see it's just a uh, sail color. It's like I said, it's it's in, in the middle between a white and, and between the mushrooms that dropped last year. Got your Nike Air on the back with that translucent uh, tab in the back and as well as a pull tab. It's got this canvas feel. Let's get both of these shoes out real quick. I know this is gonna be kind of a longer video because I am recording on my phone. I actually like this, so I like not showing my face. I might have to do this more often. So let's get these laces out of here and let's move this aside. So you got this uh, greenish 
laces that are already open, which is kind of weird, but they're already open. I'm gonna put them back right there. And it definitely matches that Nike on the, in this pod right here on the, by the forefoot or the front foot, um, part of your outsole. So it's got like that greenish, uh, light green color, as well as the insole is, is still that sail color. You got your padding, um, your foam padding on the side of the shoe, just like what Virgil likes to do with the tongue, how he likes to get this little weird uh, foam padding. And the laces are very nice. The shoe is very nice. Uh, I don't think it's a bad shoe at all. You got your hang tag right here in the sail color. Um, and it's got this very nice, uh, sale tannish looking uh, chain that comes with the hang tag then you got your uh, tag right here your off-white tag that comes uh in my preference i don't like to use it when i wear my off-whites i really don't use the tag because i don't want to break it so i just slide it right off the laces let me know if you guys wear yours with the tag or without the tag and then you got your uh silver jump man right here it's like a canvas uh material got it right here too but your frayed outline right here, the stitching. Just overall, just a very nice uh, sneaker. I really don't want to mess anything because I can't go back to the shoe only because, it, like I said, it is it is going to be shipped out. And then we got the off-white fives here, which is on, these are in my size. And I feel like I got a good deal. I got these when they were very low when the pandemic started. And side by side, the materials right here on the mud guard of the Sail Women's 4 um, is Almost, and, and the material right here is pretty much the only thing and the foam padding, you know, that you could kind of compare. But in my opinion, this is definitely just one of the, I think this this, this is a better uh, off-white than these fours only because it's, it's an OG vibe. You know, your metallic fives. You got your shark teeth in that metallic. It's just it's different. It's like a metallic, deconstructed metallic uh, off-white five is, is, is what it is. And to me, it's just, it was more thought out and just a nicer overall shoe, in my opinion. You got your red Jumpman right here. Uh, I can't wait till the bread fours. Now, I might pick these up if these go really low for some reason. If they just drop down in price, I, I might pick these up. But honestly, this is not something that I'm too uh, worked over just because I wasn't able to cop. Like, if since my girl didn't get the size, like, I wasn't too sad about it because this was not a shoe that I really, really wanted. Um, I thought it was nice and seeing it in hand it is nice But just remember that the hype is real right now and give it if you really want these and you're gonna pick them up for resale Just remember just wait wait it out. These will drop in price right now. This is the hot item This is what's new. This is what's popping. It's on everybody's Instagram and it will be on everybody's Instagram for the next two weeks But just wait it out just like these These will go down and you will be able to get them at a good price or at your best price after a couple weeks once everybody gets their pairs in. But anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I, I was kind of rushed. Um, overall, I really think this shoe right here uh, is a better off-white than the fours. Um, let me know in the comment section if you disagree. That's what the comment section is for, is for us to debate and discuss on the topic in hand, which is these sales. Let me know what you guys think. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I forgot to mention it does have the off-white uh, lettering uh, right here just like uh, all your off-whites do it's got it in, inside the cage right there as well and then you do got your shoelaces on the on the shoelace but yeah man let me know what you guys think sorry about the horrible lighting but i hope you guys enjoyed the video i am more than glad to bring you guys. I i'm happy that i was able to bring you guys a a look on these because i know a lot of you guys might have hit and you guys might be looking at the reviews before you get them in hand and i love that feeling when you when you get something hyped up or something that you've been wanting and you just go around and you look up videos and you're trying to see exactly how the shoe's gonna look. Um, it's almost like a kid at Christmas morning when you're just ready to go and open up your gifts. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. It's been long enough. It's your boy Jay Hernandez. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys hit the like button and make sure you guys stay tuned for that giveaway. It's, it is this Friday, deadline is Thursday. So make sure you guys enter up and I'm out of here. Make sure you guys sub up to my boy Dirty's Got Soul because we will be doing that giveaway together. And I mean, just go watch the video. It shows you all the instructions. Y'all have a good one. It's your boy Jay Hernandez and we're out of here, man. Later.